get a grip, people. You know what grinds my gears? When I read things posted online that should have been kept to the confines of a paper journal. Kids are especially inclined to posting way too much on social media. Instead of gifting them V-Bucks for a new Fortnite skin, I'm going to recommend that you get them this $20 starter fountain pen that will help them be a more responsible, intelligent member of the human race. Let's check out the Faber-Castell Grip Fountain Pen. Faber-Castell is one of the oldest industrial companies in the world. Founded in 1761 by the cabinet maker Kaspar Faber, the company is now run by the eighth generation family member Count Anton Wolfgang von Faber-Castell, the worldwide stationary dynasty spanning 14 manufacturing plants in 10 countries continues to be passed down to the eldest male. What keeps them going for hundreds of years? their commitment to tradition, high quality, innovative products, and environmental awareness. This high standard of excellence can be seen from their most precious writing instruments to their everyday writing designs. The Grip is an entry-level fountain pen fashioned out of injection molded plastic with a tactile ergonomic design. Triangular shaped body has raised dots that feel like a massage tool for your fingertips. The soft grip area has a contoured shape that is comfortable to hold. A robust stainless steel clip attaches easily to your pocket or pen case. The grip arrives in a presentable Faber-Castell gift box and includes one international size ink cartridge in the barrel of the pen with an empty dummy cartridge installed to protect the full one from being accidentally pierced in transit. A converter is not included with the pen but can be purchased separately so you can fill it with bottled ink. The grip is available in a range of colors, from the conservative black, silver, and blue to the fun turquoise and pink. The fountain pen's stainless steel nib is offered in extra fine, fine, and medium point sizes. Let's see how the Faber-Castell grip matches up against other starter fountain pens in the same price range. The pen has a lighter feel in hand and doesn't become back weighted when the cap is posted on the back of the pen. The long grip section has a matte, rubberized feel. For this writing sample, I used Graf von Faber-Castell Gulf Blue on a Rhodia dot grid paper pad. The medium stainless steel nib has a generous flow with a slight touch of feedback. The fine and extra fine provide a thinner line, but with more feedback and a slightly drier line. Bonus fact, the jousting knights on the Faber-Castell logo came from the coat of arms of the Castell family. In 1900, Lothar von Faber's granddaughter married a Count of Castell, changing the name of the company from A.W. Faber Company to Faber-Castell. At $20, the Faber-Castell grip is one of the best options at the entry-level price point for a fountain pen that will provide quality writing experience over a long term. Like I mentioned at the start of this video, kids are spending real money on digital vanity within a video game. At least when I was a kid, I spent money frivolously on real things like pogs, trading cards, and comic books. Well, the point is, you could do far worse than investing in a writing instrument that will help you create and communicate. Thanks for watching. If you love this video and want to see more great pen videos, unboxings, and pen interviews, hit the subscribe button. You know you want to. Stay inky, my friends. Take care.